um, high result, I'm well played. Um, was that part of play a bit of a blur? <laughs> Yeah, I don't think everything has sunk in yet. Um, to be part of it, uh, to be part of that partnership and that power play, um, yeah, uh, we'll obviously reflect and see what we did. Uh, but yeah, it was unbelievable to be part of, and obviously Quinton on the other end um, playing the way he did, and I obviously could just play second fiddle. But yeah, it was special to be a part of. Um, there's a, there's a, in that 4 3 8 game, there was a, there's this um, legend of Jock Cullis saying that the bowlers did their job when um, they conceded 434 and that they were 15 short. Did you guys sort of like go out with the same mindset almost? Um, and just, just on a more serious note, was, was there any discussion that this might not be, might, might not be impossible? Yeah, funny enough, uh, when we walked off the field, uh, KG actually said uh, they 10 runs short. Um, so yeah, it probably relates to Shark uh comment there as well. Um, so yeah, look, uh, we, managed to, we managed to get over the line and play this incredible game. And obviously what, obviously today, um, I would suggest that it's equivalent to the 4-3-8 game. So to be part of it is quite good, yeah. And just a last one from me. Um, was it a, a conscious decision to try and maximize the power play and when you guys saw how much runs you actually get it, it was just a case of now just trying to get as much as you can? Yeah, absolutely. Obviously going into our batting innings with the total on board, we obviously knew how to go about it or what was expected. So yeah, we just went to the flow and um, capitalized where we could and we never had a total in mind, but uh, to come to score the, to the, the runs we did in the first six years was, was a bonus. Great, thanks, Hart. Uh, we look to switch to online now. Uh, Flores, do you want to um, kick us off? Uh, hi, Lisa, well-batted. Um, Lisa, maybe it's a bit of a joke, this whole thing about you know, being 10 months short, but uh, did you guys, when you, when you came off, I mean, you would have seen the way that Johnson Charles played. Uh, did you think that this was the kind of surface where you could uh, chase that down and just how, how did you, did you talk about this is what we need to do, we need to have a good power play, or how did you approach it? Um, yeah, look, um, KJ obviously made that comment, uh, but everyone was in the change room was quietly confident that this is really a good wicket. So we never doubted ourselves any, any, at any stage. Um, we, we believed it was a good wicket and we believed we had the, the batters in the, in the team to go out there and, uh, and chase the score down, uh, obviously, which we did. Uh, so it's just good to come on the right side of it. Um, but yeah, guys were quietly confident and always believed that uh, we could chase it down because it was really a good wicket. Thanks for those, Talbot. Thanks, Rizzi. Well played, Rizzo. Um, Thank uh, you. I, I just wanted to, to ask you, we saw a lot of good batting today and a lot of, uh, and a lot of very good shots and not a lot of slogging, actually. Uh, you know, what do you think that says about the way T20 is, is going as a, as a, as a format? Yeah, I think T20 allows for normal cricket shots, uh, still your normal stroke play. Um, it doesn't have to go out there and uh, swing from the hip from ball one. Uh, T20 still allows for, for good cricket. And um, yeah, I think everyone who contributed today, they played really good cricket shots. It wasn't a, a case of slogging. Um, yeah, there was obviously the odd occasion, but generally it was just good cricket shots and value for runs at this, uh, at this uh, venue. Hey, Rimsa. Uh, we need a question. Was there any talk on that match you were early this season with the Titans against the Knights? There was always two big scores. Was that at any stage also mentioned? Uh, sorry, can you repeat that? I didn't get it. Uh, earlier, earlier this season, there was also two big scores when the Titans played at the Knights. When Rivers got that big score, was that, that match anyway mentioned in the, the dressing room as well? No, no, guys didn't uh, mention that at all. Um, yeah, they just spoke about uh, the wicket uh, and how good it was and uh, what we have to do to go out there and get the win. Um, so yeah, no chat at all around that. Uh, chat was very simple. Um, guys knew what they had to do to go. Oh, I, guys knew what they had to do to win the game. Um, yeah, unfortunately, we we did exactly that. Thank you. Uh, Risa, you, you often kind of have the best seat in the house when, when Quinny is playing like he is. 
Um, how would you say you saw today's innings? Was there anything different to other times that you've seen him back? Or kind of what did you think made this really special? No, that's the that's the Quinny I know. Um, obviously, cricket it, you don't it doesn't come off uh, all the time. And uh, today, fortunately for him, it came off um, where the team needed it most. Um, so yeah, look, uh, that's how he plays. Um, the wicket obviously was really good again, um, which allowed for his stroke play. And uh, it was one of those days uh, that um, he found the middle. And um, yeah, special innings to to witness, especially from the other end. Thank you.